So I'm going to say this is partial truth and partial myth. The reason for that is that SPF is a measure of how fast the skin turns pink with sunscreen versus without sunscreen. Um, the actual amount of ultraviolet radiation that is blocked by the sun's rays it actually reaches about 95% with an SPF of approximately 30. So what that means is that um, you are getting um, excellent protection from an SPF 30 sunscreen, but using a higher SPF sunscreen may offer a longer duration of protection depending how it's applied. So the evidence shows that most people apply sunscreen at about a quarter to a half the amount that is recommended, and that's used actually in studies to test the SPF of sunscreens. So theoretically, if we're applying less in amount, but we apply a higher SPF, they kind of would offset each other. Really the best approach is to apply a good sunscreen that is broad spectrum, SPF 30 or higher, well initially, and then to reapply frequently.